previously on Paranormal Syndrome. Oh my god, it has a knife! And now for more spooks. Hello everybody, Washud here, and welcome back to Paranormal Syndrome. To those of you who are brave enough to return. So, last time it was pretty crazy. And we're waking up in a bed. Oh. You've woken up. Yeah, what happened after? It was a fire and it burnt. What is this place? This place? This is the Kikugawa police station. Since I got a report from your friend, when we rushed over there, you and her were passed out and we brought you here. Oh. Thank you. A girl? Someone other than me. Kajiro Yuka-kun. She was heavily injured, but it wasn't fatal. Mostly, she's now completely resting and quiet. What? Yuka's okay? What? Hold on. She was completely bludgeoned. Yuka, she's alive. Yep. Shall I introduce myself? I am the assistant inspector of the Kikugawa police station. Himuro Hitoshi. Himuro. 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 Whatever. I have been put in charge of this incident. Best regards from here on. Okay. Periods. I'd like to ask you some things. You don't seem particularly hurt, so if you don't mind, I'd like to know more about this from you. Uh-oh, girl. Do not go and start spouting off things like there was possessed demon bears. Actually, that's the truth, though, so she probably should, but they're going to think she's crazy. Okay. But you wouldn't believe me. What I would say, surely. You mean about a cursed doll. Relax. Because I'm the one in charge of this incident. Wh why I heard from Yuka-kun. While playing Hitori Kakurenbo, something really unthinkable happened. Y yuka Performing Hitori Kakurenbo. It is her responsibility that you got caught up. But please forgive her. She will re be regretting it this for the rest of her life. You yeah, probably uh, killed both of her family members. And a random guy in her bathroom. So I would probably imagine that that would be quite scarring for a young high school student. If at that time she had abandoned you, do you understand? Yes. Well, I mean, it's 50-50. She would have been fucked as well. You know, the bear would have come back to finish the job. I assure you. Or the little zombie man. But... Why do you believe me? This kind of thing. Nobody would normally believe this. Especially for police. The Kajiro family head was loitering in an impossible way. A head on the plate. A corpse in the bathroom. The lady fallen and stabbed. Just by seeing this, there's be no reason to doubt you. Oh, okay. Well, in that case... My job is only to confirm witness and the incident. You can go home now. I will take care of everything from now on. Eh? There's no way we can let the public know. You know? The one in charge would agree. It'd cause a ruckus in the police station. Sorry for saying this, but... For a doll to attack you is so far from reality. Nobody would understand. And you'd probably be a suspect. That's... I know I'm saying something ridiculous, but... You will now return to being a student as you have always been like before. This is also the reason I came here by myself, in order to keep this quiet. I don't want lots of people interrogating you. Wow, this is like a really good deal for us. Concerning this paranormal incident, it'd be best if time simply passed... And it was simply forgotten from society. What is it? You don't need to worry. Examples of this are rare. But you are not the first. Oh. There are cases other than me? Well, 
Yeah. But it was the first one I was put in charge of. Where this many people died, perhaps? Even so, we might have been spied on for a while. There are some hard-headed people in this police. Ah, I'll have confidence in them. Oh, he comes over and, like, pats you on the head. You did a good job. Oh, just for peace of mind, I'll give you some contacts. Contact them if anything comes up. Watch as he doesn't give his own. He's just like, don't, bug it. don't bother me, though. I am above that. Just bug these people instead. It's like a psychiatrist and a hairdresser. Thank you. It may just happen that before long. I might call you. There are men very well attuned to paranormal incidents, okay? Talk to them if you want to know more about it. Epic leaving. What a badass. Just gives me numbers and walks away. There's nothing about it. Yo! Hey. Oh, that's right. I did say there was another man well attuned to the paranormal, right? Huh? What are you saying all of a sudden? Well, more importantly, how is the young lady doing? Well, we got the info as fast as always. Oh my god. Tsuyoshi. Tsu... Tsuyoshi. Well, she doesn't have any injuries that stand out. She'll return to a normal life tomorrow. Except a little crazier. A pan... Oh, a pan-normal incident as we thought, right? Probably paranormal. Perfect. Then you'll also let me ask that girl a few things too, right? How rash. Even if you want to get the scoop, she's a girl caught up in paranormal incident. Leave her alone for a while. It'll be all right. No one will take notice of my craze for the supernatural. Okaga? Isn't he the gym leader of that one town? Oh, that's Koga. Whatever. Have some moderation. Yeah, bye. Just ha take this advice and I'm going to leave. Have you seen today's morning one? Saying of that chairman, Kaga has run the path of the occult, troubling society. You know, don't you? We are even putting some articles that tell the truth about some of our unsolved incidents. And who helped write those articles? Well, I do acknowledge your work, though. It's just that this incident is really big. Besides, it might also be necessary to care for her heart, too. Leave her alone for a while. I guess it'll have to be like that for now. Oh, never mind. There she is. She's fine. Hey. Are you alright now? Yes. Are you sure? You've only been laying down for like five minutes. Oh! Are you the young lady who caught up in this incident? Hey there. You're quite pretty. How about if we can talk about this incident while relaxing with some tea? Hey, Tsuyoshi, do you not understand what I am saying? From today, you are forbidden from entering. What? Hey, what do you mean? I need to tell society the truth about this incident. Um... Himuro-san, when you said someone you wanted me to meet, did you mean... No, not this guy. Sorry about that, Makoto-kun. Please, don't think too badly about me for this. He's just a weirdo. I'm the journalist, Kaga Tsuyoshi. Tsuyoshi? I don't know how to say that name. Pro I'm Tsuyoshi. Best regards. Mikoto-kun, as you know, this society is quite dangerous. If I can send you to the nearest station... Hey, hey, be dangerous. Oh. Hey, hey, by dangerous, did you mean me? What a harsh joke! Couldn't figure out the tone of that one. Ah, uh, no. It's alright. I'll go back by myself. Yeah, I feel more safe without you. Bye-bye. See ya.
Look at these two jerks. You never let a lady walk by herself. You have to at least offer. If she says she's okay walking by, wait, by herself, okay. But you always offer. Oh, my God. This is your fault, Tsuyoshi. Sorry. You are forgiven. Just kidding. You creeper. Okay. So... What? Oh. Oh no. What should I do? It looks like I got lost. Ah, oh, shit. Perhaps it would have been better if I got Himuro-san to send me. Yeah, that well, probably would have been a good idea. Is Kikugawa station this way? Okay, saving. Alrighty then. So we're just gonna walk on a road. Let's not walk in the middle of the road. That sounds pretty stupid. Nothing inside. Wear it like a helmet. Vending machine has been set here. M maybe my throat isn't so dry yet. Oh, do we have money? We don't have any money anyway! How are you planning on getting it? Empty cans are scattered about. Uh-oh. Okay, well, how about we just walk in a neat and orderly fashion behind the trees, seeing if there's any way that we can hide from the monster that's about to come murder us, because who knows? It, maybe it's an army of teddies this time, instead of just one. That would be something. Looks like there's rust on it. Pliers? Take them. Take them. Oh my god. Why would you not take tools? That are so obviously going to be helpful. Oh. Did she, so she's just getting lost. She's going to break and enter other people's houses? This girl's kind of fucked up. Dirty water is acu er, accumulating. Well, now there's... Oh. What can this be used for? You're asking me what firewood could be used for. Oh, I don't know. Maybe things like fires? I'll get mad at... Oh, wait, what? I'll get mad at if I just simply go in. Oh, I'll get mad at! Okay. Okay. Probably, what if you knocked? That's a thing. Wow, feels like I'll get sucked in. Interesting. What if you just knocked on the door? That's a thing. Or is that just a shed? Oh, an old guy! Hey. Um, excuse me. Sato. Junji. Junji. Mmm. What is it for you to come all the way to a person's field? Yum. Which way is it to Kikugawa Station? Kikugawa Station? That would be directly west from here. What? Eh? There's nothing ahead but fields. If you want to go to Kikugawa Station, then you should go back where you came from. Is that so? Thank you very much. Liar. He's lying. He is a troll. Get the pliers, grab him by the throat with him, and make him tell the truth. If you just loiter around here like this, my field will grow wild. Please leave quickly. <laughs> you do what I want, old man. Ah, the scarecrow is looking over the field. Okay. And you? This one is not looking over the field, it's just a scarecrow. There's water inside. Put salt in it and put it on the old man, he's clearly possessed. Okay, let's leave. Who wants to bet that that old guy is going to be a flippin' crazy man in about two seconds? Also, I guess we're just not going to believe him, we're just going to go east anyway. Oh. Leaving. We'll come back. Scary. Okay. Can't go that way. It's a nice tree. Huh. Oh! It's a rock. And another scarecrow. But this one's looking over the field, too. Awesome. Okay. Um, down. Oh? I am so lost. Oh, God. Kikugawa City overflows with nature. A light walk is good for your health. Mare Nagata Akahito. What? Uh, it's pretty good for your health. I, I will agree with that. Oh. 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 Hold on. I'm pretty sure that this is looping. Yep, we're lost. Eh. Demons. Demons. Demons are happening! Uh-oh. Okay. 
It's looping. Okay, so if it's looping, what are we supposed to do? I mean, obviously panic, because there's ghosts involved. Some sort of evil spirit. Maybe, oh, okay, we'll go talk to the old guy again. Because it's clearly his doing. I saw the look in his old eye. Okay. And he's going to be gone. Oh, you still here? Um, excuse me. You again? What the heck is it? Um, please don't be startled. And listen, it might be strange to say this, but I've been going around the same place for a while. Huh? Wherever I walk, I always go back to the same road. It didn't take this long for me to walk from the police station. Hey there. You might be being fooled by a fox. Ha ha. It's for real. For real? Then let's go around and see then. Oh, P please. You're not lying to me, correct? Y yes. Okay. Oh, oh, he is. Oh, he's just an item. Nope, he is not even an item. And we're not special. Well, that's too bad. Okay, is he going to make comments on stuff with us? Nope. Maybe we can go into his house with him. Nope. Well, you could just ask him. He's in your inventory. Okay. Oh, you're not with me. What up? See, I wasn't lying. Certainly, I feel an unpleasant wind somewhere. Wherever I walk, I always return to this place. Oh, to the same place. What is going on? It occurs ever so rarely in the countryside for something strange like this to happen. Really? Well, there's nothing we can do about this. It's best to just let it go when something like this happens. Good night! Then he just goes back into his house and just says, Good luck! You can sleep in a cart. Is that so? It'd also be boring to just stand here stupefied until things calm down and I have a lot of room in my home. Oh, he's a nice old guy. Thank you for offering your home to me. Ha, huh, thank you. Oh. Oh. What the? It was just a picture of the countryside. Is something the matter for you to stand here like this? Uh, no. Nothing big. I think I saw something like a white haze. Hmm? Let me see, then. You can't see it? I'll need to put on some glasses. Let's see. So... It's strange, isn't it? It's moving, or moving as if it were living, but... Um, can you see it properly, you old fart? I don't know, don't know! Huh? WHAT THE HELL HAPPENED TO HIM?! What? What's happening?! Oh my god! Oh my god! They're the flippin' naked running men! Oh god! Get in there! Oh god, don't- oh, Okay, I get it, I get it, I get it! What the hell just happened? Okay, saving. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Recap. Recap time with Washu. Old man was nice. Old man got possessed. Went crazy. Little white guy came running after me like a naked streaker. We ran into the house. We turned on white noise. And it was too relaxed and it ran away. What the fuck is happening? That old man. He was riding a haiku, right? 
Um, is that a reference to something? There's clothing inside. Naturally. It's been quite used. Are you judging everyone's belongings again? There's a telephone put here. Use it. That's right! I did get Himuro-san's cell phone number. There it is. Would have immediately committed that to memory. The line's been cut. No, just kidding. Not yet. Yes, who is this? Himuro-san, it's me. Himeno Mikoto. Mikoto Kunun? What the heck is it? Is something the matter? Um... I got lost, I think. Oh my god, please say something about the strange white blob chasing you. And not simply lost. I'm going around the same place over and over. What? And not just that. A white... Something white is chasing me. An old man was with me on the way, but... While he was looking at it, he suddenly went crazy. Calm down. Wait. Let me sort this out a little. Understood. Okay, Makotokun. I don't know who will call you, but it's dangerous to move from there. I'll go there right away, so tell me where you are. This is directly east from the police station, a field road with lots of scarecrows. I'm using the phone from a nearby house. Understood. I'll go there by car right away. Oh my god! <laughs> hey, Makotokun! Uh oh. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're fine. Oh my god. So, are we gonna have to throw something else at him? I mean, he's not exactly that threatening. Oh god! <laughs> okay, I deserved that one. I was just like, it's not threatening at all, and immediately die. Okay. Let's see. Are we just not able to use this one? Okay, that one's a friggin... It's a trap. Okay. We can't throw that. Oh god, it's fast. Oh god! <laughs> Okay, let's try this again. But this time, let's just run in a completely different direction. I have a feeling that that direction is nothing but murder, so... I mean, this little guy is actually kind of cute if you don't think about it too hard. I mean, he's clearly a violent little fuck, but at the same time... Oh, what the hell is this place? What? We couldn't get here before? Oh, God! It doesn't like noise. Oh... Okay, so next time just scream like a banshee. Probably okay. Look at all his food. Oh my god. Lined with various... Retort? What the fuck is retort? Okay. I'm not hungry. Someone will get angry at me if I just take one. Yeah, the total lack of people that are here. I mean, I probably wouldn't steal from something even if people weren't looking, but... Perhaps it doesn't like sound. That's my interpretation. Oh! What is this back area? Okay, so now we're by- Oh! Oh! Are you kidding? Oh, it's happy! Okay, I get it. It thinks it's funny. It thinks this is a joke. Okay. Oh! Use the scarecrow. Hell yeah. Oh. Okay. Alright. That was not what I was planning, but that works too! It's dumb. Oh, God. That was clever. Good for you. Okay. Thank you, Scarecrow. The Scarecrow is looking over the field and blocking the bodies of, you know, 17 to 18-year-old girls. Excellent. Thank you so much. I love you forever, Scarecrow. Scarecrows are the best, if you think about it. All right. So he was guarding something over here. What was he guarding? His favorite swing set. His sis. Oh. He broke the playground equipment. Playing in the sand. Ah, oh, the old times. Don't sit there and play in the sand. Perhaps something someone forgot. Looks like no one here. Oh. Okay. So this was... This was not the place to go. So we just buy in time? We're just waiting? It's getting warmer. What is... Okay. Um, we just have to wait, right? Because there's a car coming. Stand in the middle of the road. Hmm. 
Hiei Shrine. Built in 1632 after being reconstructed several times, it now looks over Kika, Kikugua, Kikagua. I, I had it before, dang it, city. Forgot immediately how to say it. Saving! Saving! What about this way? And life sucks. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. This time without restarting. Oh. Oh, we didn't look at the creeper city either. Okay, I forgot, sorry. I'll be able to neatly wash my hands here. Okay, but why would we wash our hands? What the? Hello? It's scary to continue looking at this. A komainu with a scary expression. Okay. Hello, you. Hey. Um. You have been cursed. <laughs> 